To your state where Governor Shayi Makinde says his administration will apply homegrown solutions to meet the demands of labor unions in the state to ameliorate the effect of petrol subsidy removal. The governor said this during a meeting with leadership of the labor unions in Ibadan, the Oyo state capital. Olaide Oyewale has more in this report. Governor Shayi Makinde convened the meeting to announce the formation of an 11 member ad hoc interministerial committee taxed with harmonizing the demands presented by the labor unions in the state. This decision coincides with a period when the nation's labor force is advocating a raise in the minimum wage to alleviate the impact of fuel subsidy removal. The committee's objective is to formulate strategies and assess the labor union's request to alleviate the ongoing hardship encountered by their members as a result of the fuel subsidy removal. So that note, uh, I uh, will pronounce uh, the, um, uh, the ad hoc uh, interministerial committee uh, uh, inaugurated and uh, we hope uh, we can have a report or a roadmap uh, within the shortest possible time. The leadership of the labor union assured that the committee will develop sustainable plans that will be beneficial to the masses and the state's workforce. The sovereign is already on ground. We put in our best to make sure we arrive at a conclusion in a, in a very short time. And we make sure we, will, we have to consider the neighboring states so, so that uh, we won't have ourselves shot at our feet. At our feet. So we, we may have to endure some patience. And he said, the issue of wage award is paramount on our hearts. There are various other issues, but we believe that that is the one on the front burner. And we will, just like he said, we want to give it the priority and the urgency that um, it, it needs. So that is going to be the most important thing on our, and we want to complete it as early as possible so that our people too will start enjoying what others are enjoying. The committee is expected to deliver on their mandate within a period of four weeks. Oladio Yewole, TVC News, Ibadan.